A beautiful evening and a great crowd greeted the biggest race of Remington's spring quarter horse meeting, the $1 million Heritage Place Futurity. The country's top two-year-old quarter horses running 350 yards for the winner's share of $420,000. Winner of the Grade 1 Remington Park Futurity, number 10, Lano Teller. Trained by Heath Reed, he was ridden by Freddie Martinez in his bid for another Grade 1 tally. Freight Train B, number 9, was the top qualifier from the second night of Futurity Trials. One of three horses in the race trained by Eddie Willis, Freight Train B had Jimmy Brooks in the saddle. Trainer Ed Hardy saddled number 8, Dahlberg. David Pinion had the ride. Dahlberg's stablemate, given it a royal effort, had never won a race and was lightly regarded by the crowd on hand. And we didn't get a shot of him. But here he is at the Ed Hardy barn a week before the race. He was ridden in the futurity by Stormy Smith. Ricky Ramirez, the jockey on number one, Jolton Jess, who's trained by Heath Taylor. And Knuckles O'Toole, another from the Eddie Willis training barn, ridden by Matthew Casebolt. They're all in the gate. Let's get the call from Remington Park track announcer, Dale Day. They're off in the Heritage Place Futurity. Lano Teller came away sharply. Knuckles O'Toole right there, also coming on strong, giving it a royal effort. And in the mix, it is Crazy Down Corona. Giving it a royal effort, Crazy Down Corona. Knuckles O'Toole still fighting freight train B. Lano Teller to the outside. Anyone's race as they come to the line. It's a line of six. Photo finish. Breaking his maiden in the million dollar Heritage Place Futurity. Giving it a royal effort. Stormy Smith, the winning jockey in the grade one event. All legitimate contenders in this race and it was a thriller at the end. You could throw a blanket over five or six at the wire. But it was giving it a royal effort. Prevailing by a head over Knuckles O'Toole, Lano Teller and nose back in third. Giving it a royal effort is owned by the partnership LMR 2010. He's trained by Ed Hardy. The colt was bred in California by Abigail Kawananakoa, a son of First Down Dash and the special effort mayor Delphia, given it a royal effort. Stop the clock at 17.409 seconds, good for a speed index of 98. If you ask anybody that's involved, I said if the if the red horse, if he leaves with him, he doesn't have to outbreak him, but if he leaves with him, he's going to make it tough on him, and he did. Anytime you get in this kind of race, it's as tough as they come, and all these horses were prepped and ready to go, and I'm just glad we were a part of it. We just had a perfect trip. The horse stood up in there and left real good and run his eyeballs out. From maiden to grade one winner, in less than 18 seconds, giving it a royal effort, lives up to his name in the 2010 $1 million Heritage Place Futurity.